Hello and welcome to a special business bulletin reacting to the news that Cadbury's new owner Kraft Food plans to close its Summerdale plant near Bristol. I'm here with John Griffin that's, who's been covering this story. So John, tell us what's been happening. Well it's quite alarming news. Uh, less than a week after the Cadbury takeover uh, went through, Kraft now announced, confirmed that Summerdale plant is to close. Uh, extraordinary really given that uh, there had been suggestions more than suggestions that, the, that they were looking at it to keep it open uh, but now uh, the, the Summerdale plant uh, will go and that means 400 jobs are going and as I say it's, it's very very soon into this takeover. Yeah and as you say this, this seems to conflict with some of the things that Kraft were saying when they were trying to buy Cadbury in the first place. It more than conflicts I've got the statement in front of me which they issued on uh, December the 12th last year uh, I'll just quote from it briefly, briefly. It says, as well as investing in Bourneville, we want to keep the Summerdale plant open, which Cadbury planned to close. We offer the best prospects for British manufacturing jobs. We are by far the best partner for Cadbury. Um, those statements look rather strange in the light of the announcement overnight. Yeah, it seems like quite a climb down. Um, does this uh, increase worries for jobs here in Birmingham? Well, it's got to, hasn't it? I mean, if you were a Bourneville worker this morning, what would you, how would you be feeling? Um, there, there are clearly implications um, from this and um, we, we just have to wait to see uh, what this does mean for Bourneville but all, all, we, all we do know now is that these jobs are going uh, and they weren't going a week ago. Thank you for that John. Now, obviously you'll be able to read more about this on our BirminghamMail.net and BirminghamPost.net websites and there'll be more on the, on the Cabri News in both newspapers. Thanks for watching, see you again tomorrow. What one?